her life can flow so much more powerfully. I know that sounds strange to say flow more powerfully, but they are the two perfect marriage of words. Lead as you would follow. It's taught me what kind of leader do I want to be in my family, as a wife, as a mother, as a coach, as a retreat facilitator, you name it. I want power within. I want to be able to feel comfortable enough and vulnerable enough in myself to be able to look and say, I don't know if I made the right choice on that. What do you think, Sarah? Or what do you think about this? Give me your honest opinion. And when you are strong in yourself and healing the masculine and the feminine, you can take that. It may not feel good, but you can take that because you know you are a strong leader for listening to those around you. Power over is extremely masculine. It is so outdated. It is archaic at this point, but we keep trying to shove it down people's throats. And I guarantee you, that's why I'm sharing it. If you can look in your life, whether it's your own boss or within a family member or a friend, or you can see where they're being power over and power over comes from fear. Power over comes from an unhealed masculine divine energy where I must have control over everything or I will lose everything. It's very fear-based. So if you're seeing someone being power over, not power within, I can guarantee you that is not a healed nor balanced masculine divine energy. And that's important because we can do that too when we're fearful. Um, we want to control. Don't speak to me that way. You can't say that to me. I am in control. Hmm. This is a reminder to get into the feminine divine more. It's not hustle, hustle, hustle. Go, 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 right? And you feel out of sorts. No one wants a go, 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 right? You can set your intention. You can be powerful. You can be aligned and you can get it done without killing yourself, without your body losing it to you being out of alignment. And so this is a reminder to go into that flow to float, to show up for need, what needs to be done, be consistent, be true to your word, be authentic, right? Balance the showing up and consistency of the feminine, masculine divine with the flow of the feminine. Like no one to say, okay, I need a lunch break. I need to go for a walk. Nothing else is coming in right now. And me pushing it even further in a masculine energy is not bringing anything to the table. So it's time for me to take a break. Both of these are both. It's not one that, see, I told you there. It's not one that's masculine and one that's feminine. It's the energy of both and recognizing it in yourself and those around you. Plus, hopefully you needed to hear both those messages today.